How can a collection of mindless, thoughtless particles somehow yield mindful experience? Yeah. Um, well, I've spent I've spent some time thinking about this question. I think it's perhaps the deepest question that faces science or even humanity at some level. And um, my own personal perspective is that consciousness is nothing more than the choreographed motion of particles in various quantum states inside a gloppy gray structure that sits inside this thing that we call a head. Do I have any proof for that? No. Does anybody have any proof for what consciousness is? Not at all at this moment. But the history of the reductionist program where we've been able to take some of the more spectacular creations that have emerged in the world and recognize that they are nothing but product of their ingredients and the laws of physics leads me to extrapolate that idea to the experience of consciousness. Having said that, there's a deep puzzle. It's called the hard problem of consciousness, which is if electrons and quarks and particles and laws of physics are all that there is, and if you buy into the fact that electrons don't have an inner world, that quarks don't have an inner world, how can it be that by taking a collection of those particles, you can turn on the lights?